I came to Inglis, I realized that this was a organization of the highest professional caliber, which meant that if I contributed anything, there would be people here to back me up. I first became aware of the ACE program by looking online and looking for funding opportunities. And the ACE program stood out because it was money that was unrestricted. So it would allow me to start to dream about how I would use a little bit of money to try a new program. We were looking for ways to expand the awareness in the community of what Inglis represented. And so we were trying to figure out ways to connect to the part of the community that was already living independently in the community. The ACE Awards are really our effort to both recognize organizations that are rarely recognized by the rest of society and celebrate the good work that they do for our community, but also a recognition that there's just not enough money to go around. So we thought that if we could marshal a few resources and offer an award, we could get inside those organizations. We could get to know them better and they could get to know us better. And through that, not only would we create a bigger network, but we might find some strategic partners. People think about Inglis being Inglis House, but we serve twice as many people in the community. So more, the more support we can provide to community-based services, the more that they can live great lives and, and pursue things that really mean a lot to them. Mainline Deputy Dog is a, an organization we help people with disabilities train their own service dogs. We do two different kinds of service dogs, mobility dogs for people with uh, mobility um, challenges and then psychiatric service dogs which are very similar. They both do tasks that alleviate the situation that the person is in. The money that Inglis gives to its partner organizations or organizations that apply for the ACE Awards it's, it's our way of investing smartly in other organizations, and if we keep investing in them, they in turn will invest further in the consumers that we care so much about. Deputy Dog is different than traditional organizations is that they, in that they raise puppies um, and train them as service dogs, and Mainline Deputy Dog rescues dogs from area shelters, so we're helping people that need a service dog with local dogs. So it's people helping dogs and dogs helping people, um, which is a, a great mission, I believe. To award a grant for unrestricted funds gives an organization the flexibility to use it for whatever their greatest need is. Every organization has overhead, every organization has needs that come up, and to give them that flexibility and that support just for their ongoing operations to continue to do the great work that they do is something that we take really great satisfaction in because those awards are not as common as one might think. What we learned is that the folks who were applying for awards and who received awards were desperate to get together to learn about topical issues um, from experts. It becomes a matter of leveraging. In other words, not everybody can do everything. And there are such a wide range of things that can be done and actually are being done. And so it makes sense to have a way in which those can be brought in a kind of a coordinated way to people with disabilities. So collaboration is hugely important for us. And, uh, and it, first of all, it's, it provides us the ability to really stretch our resources. You know, if, if we can collaborate and partner with other smart, capable people who share our mission, um, we can do much better work together than we can do alone. Another aspect of the ACE Awards is the connectedness in the community. By reviewing applications, I've now probably learned about at least 25 organizations that I didn't know existed, and I'm pretty connected. There are so many people doing such good work, as you see with all of the awards recipients over the last 10 years, that you know we've just gained an enormous amount, both in terms of our knowledge from what they're doing, but also from their advice and partnership. I think the ACE Award, you know, it's helping us know each other and helping support those programs so that they too can take a risk and try to do something more. 
A life well lived is a life that includes pets and it includes athletics and it includes performing arts and it includes social services. Life is full of all these component pieces and we're just representing a cross-section of life right here.